If you ever try to type in not Latin language or Linux, you probably know that it's not that much obvious as it could seem. So in this tutorial in particular, we are learning how to type in Japanese. But the same technique can be used also for Chinese, for Korean or other languages. So let's start with that. For this tutorial, I choose Xubuntu 18.04, but the same procedure is also similar for other distributions. Just maybe your packet names are different a little bit, and the graphic user interface procedure is a little bit different, but the concept is the same and the programs are the same. So let's just um, proceed installing the um, graphic package manager for the Ubuntu, which is super user to apt install synaptic. Synaptic, okay. Okay, so let's open synaptic. Let's input the password. And now we need um, a particular package, which is um, FCETX. In particular, also, there is FCETX MOSC, which is the input method. So we have the framework FCETX and the input method, which is MOSC for Japanese. But if you are here for Chinese or Korean or other languages, just search for FCETX and you're gonna get a lot of packets. It's a list with all the input methods and packets. We need MOSC, so let's mark for installation. And all these packages are gonna be installed. That's okay, mark. And also we want Chinese, some pidgin. And for Korean, I'm not sure, but should be a CTX angle. Even if here it says that it is for Chinese, free Chinese input, but online I saw that this is for Korean. Just try it and confirm it. So mark and nothing else. One particular thing that you have to note is that on uh, this version of Ubuntu, uh, probably all the others that will come, automatically install some packets, which are libfctx, uh, where is, okay, qt5, and also the packets for gtk, uh, which are not installed by default. For example, if you have uh, Arch Linux, where you have these packets, which are called fctx jtk2, fctx jtk3, and qt5. You have to manually install this, or of sure you, you can just install CTX input method uh, as, as a group. But by default, if you don't do that, you won't have this. And as you noted, the name is different. Here is libfctx on Arch is fctx dash. So just take a search before. Okay, so apply. 69 megabytes have to be downloaded, that's okay. And see you in a while. Okay, so the installation has finished. We can close the synaptic. And let's test it. Okay, let's test it. Obviously it is not gonna work because we don't have it to open it. So let's open it. FCTX, just FCTX, and let's configure it also. So FCTX, configure. Okay, you can see that I have Italian as a keyboard, but you could have, for example, English or German, I don't know your language, but we need also Japanese. So on the bottom left, we have the plus icon, and we can search here for Japanese, Motsk, which does not display because we have checked only show current language. Just uncheck it and search for Mosk or just type it. Mosk. 
just note that we have mosque and we don't have uh, Japanese. We have Japanese on the right. So search for mosque. Okay. Now we have two input methods, but we don't know how to switch this. To switch this, we have to go to the global config tab and trigger input method control space. Perfect. So just use it. But if you don't like that, just like me, I prefer super space. Okay. Just change it. We can close it and test if the thing works. Okay, I'm just using the search tab. Super space. Doesn't work. Okay, no problem. Let's try with mousepad. Let's try it. Oh, here it's working. Fantastic. It is working, but we also want to type, for example, that or into KTE. Here also it doesn't work. It doesn't work because uh, um, the input method is not globally uh, enabled. So just global enable it. <laughs> For this meaning, we, um, we need to go to the home folder on directory, create a document called uh, dot pem underscore environment environment and let's create it. Obviously you can see that because it's hidden. So view show hidden files and dot pem environment has been created. Remember the dot, it's important. Okay, so let's open it. And uh, we need to paste in there three lines, which are these. You can find it on the bottom of the video, don't worry. What does it say? That we have SCTX set it as default X modifier, as uh, input method for GTK applications and for Qt applications. So that's what we want. Okay, let's try to save it. And uh, log out okay login again this time we should be able to type but it doesn't work it doesn't work because uh, uh, we need to open it so sctx and let's try again that it is working also here uh, let's try on KT. KT. Yatta! It works! Excellent! But we want also to, to auto start. So on the settings tab, settings, if you have Xubuntu, if you don't have Xubuntu, you also will have a setting tab, but maybe in a different place. Let's go for session and startup application auto start and we need to check facetx which is not present so let's add it add name let's call it fcetx and the command can be typed or chosen so let's choose it it's uh, in file system user bin and fctx here it is. Okay. So next time we are gonna power the computer on, the framework will automatically be loaded. So log out and pass word. And we are in. So let's try it. That. And also works. Cool. Here on the top right can be confirmed. Maybe I have a video here. Here, <laughs> can be confirmed. Okay, so how to use it? Just open gate. We can type in Japanese in uh, Kana, normally, for example, Kitsune, but we can also type it in uh, Kanji. But how to do that? Just type, uh, no type, press, just, just press the tab. Okay, and here we can choose between various suggestions. 
we can use the tab or the uh, the up and down arrows. Okay, so Kitsune. Kitsune. No. What? Okay, it works. Perfect. Uh, that's all. I hope uh, this helped. And just as completion, completion, we are also going to use uh, to enable Sun Pijin for China and also Hangul for Korean. Okay, let's try if it works. So Mosk, it doesn't. Let's try to close and open again. Oops, key. So Mosk, okay, it doesn't work. It doesn't work because, sorry, okay. It doesn't work because uh, um, it seems like we can only have uh, one input method for not letting uh, languages. I don't know why. It is a mystery, but if we remove Motsk and try again, we have Angle. Angle, I don't know Korean, but you can try and it should appear something. <laughs> you will probably know Korean better than me and <laughs> just typing randomly. Okay, and now we want Sampinjin. It also doesn't work, so remove it. Sampinjin. Sampinjin. Um, I also don't know Chinese, so I'm gonna type randomly. And it works similarly to Japanese, so just type. But I don't know Chinese, so I'm very, <laughs> I'm very bad at it. Just try it, uh, comment in your language if you have succeeded in this. And if you find a way to um, use multiple, uh, <laughs> not Latin uh, languages on uh, FCTX, please uh, uh, write in the comments uh, the solution, because I really cannot do that. I just can add one input method. For non Latin. So this uh, is Francesco Yoshi. Hope uh, this video helped and see you. Bye. Or better, Matane.